back. <laughs> it's me, Jermaine Kalanda, back with another one. <laughs> this is going to be pop day. Um, I'll give you a pop day next week, and I'll tell you why. Pop day takes so much work, and I have to give you topics and everything, in my opinion. So that's what it's, that's about. I wanted to give you kind of like another like motivating video. So what I've been thinking about mainly is like trying again. Because there's a thing about like this um, panorama, <laughs> if you will, that you have to learn how to retry. Like you had to re learn how to re go to the gym. You had to learn to re go to work. We're alone to be in public again. And some people are like, oh, who's in public? I'm still quarantined. Proud of you. But also, come on, join us in the world. And I had to learn to redo a lot of stuff over time. I was very blessed with the fact that I had. <laughs> I, didn't, I didn't have to stop anything. I had just started comedy, 2020, and then a few months later, I started improv, and around that time, we did mass mics, so most of my comedy career has, boop, 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 boop. <laughs> and so has my, um, so has me being, me, part, me being part of improv, so my improv helped me being around people, and I recommend improv to, like, every last person in the world, because... I feel as though people don't realize how awkward you are now compared to you once were. And it's not something that you don't always notice. I've always noticed I was an awkward person before and after. I'm over. I give people a lot of information at times. I tell people my business at times. And also, I'm over listening. I listen to everything people say. Which you ask the question, like, why is that? Because I just do. And it's not always the thing that I requirely do. But I just... How can I say this? I feel as though the world is seeing people at times. Sometimes the world isn't seeing anyone at all. And sometimes you don't feel seen. You yourself may not feel seen. But I see you. I know that you're working hard. I know that you're doing what you can do. I see that you're working out. I see that you're doing the best you can. And that's kind of what trying again does. You try again at the gym. Me going back to the gym, 2020 was... The hardest time to get back at a gym. 2021 is when I really like worked out at a gym. I was at a park a lot. I had to retrain myself. Even right now, today I went to the gym and I hadn't gone to the gym like truly hardcore for like a week. And I've been like back at it. Like I had a show Saturday that I was like in that needed my body, <laughs> needed my body to be a little bit in shape. So I was like, we will do this today at the gym. And then after that, I do that all the time. Like, I still, I still did cardio the day before. I'm just doing the best I can every day. You know what I mean? When you go to work, your work has changed. A lot of people used to wear masks all the time. Now, mask mandate is not the requirement. But some of y'all are wearing masks. Some of you are not wearing masks. And I feel whatever works for you, you know? Because your safety to me matters the most. I'm very vaccinated. I've been vaxxed for a long, long period of time. I got all three. I got my fourth one I got to get properly. But what I'm saying as an instance is this. You have to do the best you can for yourself every single day. When you try again, it's a, it's a, like a rekindlement of life. Doing the best you can to get you to the next needle. If you try that day and try again that next day and keep going and keep going and keep going, you win. I don't know what you'll win, but you'll win life to my book. Yes, there's those in the back. My brother's here. Yeah, so <laughs> that's just my thought process. Um, what about the trying again? Is that I done? I had to try a lot of stuff to make it those here. So that's the question, like... Why do we have to try? I think it's just still living. And I feel as though people keep forgetting that we're in tra we've been traumatic. We have a trauma. We have a trauma bond in life now. Because you talk about the pandemic with anybody, they'd be like, "Yeah, that happened. I can't believe that happened. Something happened in 22. I just don't know what." Uh, 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 uh. Mm -hmm. And that's true. It is true. I think people got to figure out what they want in life and i hope and i pray 
on your discovering on becoming a better person, better self, is that you'll see or seek life out. I understand a lot of people are very like closed minded after the pandemic. Oh, as as it's still going on. It's hard to reconnect with people. Try to reconnect with people because most of the most of that time I still talk to my friends. I have now like a whole roster of new friends that I like probably trust in my life. Even probably even more than my regular friends. I'm not saying there's no there's no difference between them. It's just you know <laughs> comedy. But I really want you to try though. I hope you get out of your way. Because you trying to get out of your own way probably help you immensely. And you trying to love yourself is hard. I am not living proof, but proof that it's going to take you some while to like understand what you got going on. And that you matter more than anyone else in this world. I don't think everyone sees themselves sometimes. Um, as to every last person I know. Because something about not seeing yourself, I feel as though it's criminal at times. That you don't really get fully, fully seen and fully heard. Which sucks. But it's honest. Because this world is not meant to, for everyone to be heard at times. You should be heard in your life. You should be talked to, talked to someone in your life. You should have a go-to in your life. I hope... That these conversations that we're having help you. It makes you try. Because I think you trying will help you build your community back. Build your soul back. Build your essentials back. Your essentials to me is these many people in your life. I don't care if they're friends or family. And other than that, everyone else is a bonus friend. Like I should be your bonus friend. But until then, maybe I'm your five. And I'm glad I'm part of your five. Figure out the balance. Retry balance. I'm trying to do that myself with this week. But at the same time, I'm trying my best to be there for myself. Put myself first. More and more every day. I hope that you can too. And with all that said, that's kind of it. Um... I will give you another video soon, probably in three, in two days. I may record it real quick. I don't know. I have ideas. I have ideas. I do. <laughs> My hair looking crazy, y'all. I'm so sorry. I'm going to keep looking at y'all. And what else? What else? What else? What else? That's kind of it. If you want to support this channel, share this video. If you want to support this channel, share this video. If you want to support this channel, watch this video two, me three more times. If you want to support me as a person, Venmo me at Jermaine Calendo or Venmo or Cash App me, which I'll try to have Cash App like right here and the Venmo right here. I do have a PayPal. I'll upload old notes that I have. I'm going to copy and paste that. And so it'll be that. And you'll be like, oh, what's this? It's different. I'm sorry. <laughs> all in all, I hope you feel woke, feel woken, feel seen, feel heard, and that you're willing to retry. <laughs> Bye, y'all. I love y'all.